Hey guys, and welcome back to more of Mother 3. What are we doing? Are we starting the game over? No, we're not starting the game over. We're starting... Well, we're starting what seems like a new game. Something that was pr pretty much missing from all the other Mother games. Was this. Stories told from different perspectives. I mean, sure, Mother 2 had, you know, when you got to play as a... Uh, when you got to play as... Uh, what's his name? Man. That's gonna bother me the entire episode. Jeff, yeah, when you got to play as Jeff and when you got to play as Pooh. But that was pretty much it. Yeah, it was a terrible tragedy. That's good. It occurs to me that I may have uploaded videos past this, but that's okay. You know why it's okay? Because my save's actually deleted. I had to play up to this point again. The only time your flint ever talks. Your flint, yeah. Sure. Well, except for when you say yes or no form. And? Da da! Chapter 2 Thief Adventure! That was terrible. That's not a tune that can really be sung to. Oh, are we gonna hear some crazy rock music and everything's gonna explode? No, I guess not. That's too bad. I was really hoping for some really loud rock music and explosions, but I guess I was bound to be disappointed. Sorry about this light in the corner. I'm trying to cover it with my face, I guess. I don't know. Let's sit over here. Lean over this way. But as my pupil. What about it, Dad? Listen, what am I doing? The time has come. No, this is definitely not something we have been work looking forward to. I know it didn't say definitely there, but I added it for emphasis. I hope the time wouldn't come if at all possible, but it was inevitable. But you and I have been constantly preparing for the day in this event it did come. In the event it did come. So it appears uh, you, have finally, you finally have a chance to try out what I have taught you. Good lord. I can enunciate my speech correctly. Enemy's form is still unknown. No, we saw them. They have pig faces. But we must now change the way we live. Are you prepared? No. I'm not prepared to change the way I live. I don't like change. Yeah, maybe. Really? At least it's my vague recollection of it. Yeah, this is where you start to see little plot holes, if it were. But they'll all be explained in due time. It's all my fault. Or so I seem to remember. Those lines are become important later. If it'll make you happy, you can begrudge me all you want. But you don't get a choice in this matter. Oh, that's no fair. I want a choice in this matter. It's not a test or anything of the sort. This is an order. Oh, crap. Esther, I'm now going to give you a mission. A mission? Is it going to be impossible? Well, that doesn't seem too hard. A certain important in uh, an important item. Isn't that castle like deserted? That should be pretty simple. Still, would you like to know a little bit about it? Yeah, I'd like to know a little bit. It's very important looking at him. It's like all shiny. Yeah. I'll say no more than that. What, do you think people will be listening? In the basement you'll find items are for the seven mystical thief tools. No, wait, were there seven? Well, whatever. Take them with you. They'll prove to be useful during your battles with the enemy. Now watch what happens if you try to go outside without the seven mystical tools. Haven't you been listening? Take the slightly less than seven tools in the basement with you. That's pretty funny. The slightly less than seven tools, because there's actually only five. You get one, the Hypno Pendulum, that'll put enemies to sleep, allowing you to hear the beats. There's the Tickle Stick, it will lower their defense. There's the Scary Mask, it will lower their offense. Uh, the enemy's offense, I mean. There's the Smoke Bomb, it will induce crying, which lowers... It's like Blind in the Final Fantasy game, lowers accuracy. And this is the Siren Beetle. It will turn enemies around, which makes getting back sprites a lot easier, although I'm not doing that in this outlet, in this Let's Play. We're just gonna play it and have fun. And also, that would just be kind of boring. I don't know. I've never played the game like that. If you want to, you totally can. That's, you know... If you get all the back sprites and front sprites in the game, then, uh... You get a special thing at the end. You can't go to the left. There's nothing over there. I've tried going to the fort. Who is this? Oh, Paul didn't... Uh, I have to think of a good voice for the guy. Hold on. 
Oh, pardon me. I wasn't paying attention. Ugh, this is gonna be so hard. I'm sorry, but we are in a terrible hurry. If you'll excuse us. Come on now, little monkey. We should be off. Monkey, uh, your friendly trainer guy is calling you away. Why'd you look him back? Hmm. Somehow that little monkey gives me a weird vibe. Like, as if he's being held. I don't know what that means. Oh, what was in that bag? You promise not to tell anyone, but you're not a cool secret. It's a bag. What about it? I don't really care what's inside. Oh, well, okay. What's a money? Oh, well, yeah. I guess not. An arrow of what? Traveler. Was he that guy who just came by? Definitely a friend worth having. Oh, I'm sure. That seems like a terrible place to hide money. Just go with your mattress. It's always good. Now this is funny. Obtain 50,000 DP of money. Holy sweet. Ah, but you put it back. Duster's a good person. He would never steal like that. Or you're the safe frog. Might as well... Uh, no, not now. I'll go later. Oh, by the way, here's the regards of the next of the last frog we went to. Dude, stop jumping up my butt. It's weird. Here we get a cutscene for absolutely no reason. I don't understand why they did this. Oh wait, actually, never mind. I thought it was just a pan, but actually, there is a little bit more to it than uh, meets the eye. <sighs> I always overcompensate. Yeah. Oh, phone, what are you doing? Oh, well, no. Fairly fixed. That's okay. Wait, listen to this music. I love this song. What does it say? Sunset Graves. Sunset Ceremonies. Sunset Cemeteries. The graves has never looked so seen it. No zombies allowed. I bet they're pretty strict about that. Hmm. What kind of music is, uh... Oh! That's not allowed. You have to leave the cemetery. No zombies allowed. Why do you look similar to, uh, Ness, Klaus, or someone? Maybe you're Ninten! I bet nobody's ever thought of that. Well, I'm sure they have. I'm alive! What the hell? And this kind of looks like Paula to me. I don't know why. Except, you know, with resemblances to Hinawa. I don't want Hinawa to be here. She's buried somewhere else. Didn't I die? No, you didn't die. Look at them shake back and forth. They're not even in rhythm, guys. You're doing it wrong. Don't live more. That's how I always imagine them saying it. Okay, back away, Duster. We can get out of this. There's only three of them. Oh, crap. Ew, that's gross. There's like a part of her head that isn't covered with hair. That's gross. Not that her hair is probably clean. Her hair is probably disgusting. What time are we going to do? Eight. Okay, that's good. Ah. That was a weird... Ah. Oh, never mind then. Yeah, they have about 90 HP each. This is a really cool beat, though. I like it a lot. I wish I could play this on the guitar uh, on the on the drums. Oh, I did it wrong. I should not be so focused on the combos, but, you know, whatever. Combos make this game really fun, and I don't want to make it unfun for myself, because then, you know, it's boring for you guys to watch, because I'm bored. That's usually, that's actually probably the best run of that fight I've ever had. So if you run through here, there won't be anything here. Nippolite's gonna be here. Oh, it's old man Wes's son. What's his name? Yeah, see, he didn't raise us to fit in with the other villagers, and so they don't really know who I am. Yeah, I guess I do. I'm not any, on any kind of mission at all. So let's go in the... Aw, oh, this complicates things considerably. The bridge is up. How are we ever supposed to get in there? 
This sunlight on the thing is making this not seem like a very nice thing. Watch where you're stepping, will ya? I'm like standing right here. I'm an ant. Don't you dare step on me. I've been watching you fight for a while now, but I just can't take it anymore. Fights are all about rhythm, you know, like boom, 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 and stuff. When you're in battle, there's a very specific rhythm that matches the enemy's beat. Pick up on that rhythm and victory will be yours. If you're really good, you can even pull up 16 hit combos. I hereby name these sound battles. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Anyway. That was awesome. I always like those little things, but at the same time, they kind of interrupt everything. And and now you're going to start seeing enemies and the hardest beat in the game. This is the hardest combo in the game. One, two, three, and four. One, and two, three, and four. I'll see if I can demonstrate a little bit of this. Three, and four. One, and two, three, and four. Ah! I'm so bad at this... But then again, everybody is. And then these guys die too easily. But we'll be getting an item that allows you to practice up on those kind of beats. But there you go. Now, I'm gonna try taking on one of these guys. And I'm probably gonna die. So, uh, that'll be a good note to end the video on. But these guys have a really fun beat to play around with too. Use a Snyder Beetle on them the week to that. So they usually turn around. As you can tell, the beats uh, the beat generally goes a little bit faster. It gets really fast, and then it slows way down, and then it gets faster again. This song is called Accelerando. It's a really good song. Ah! I jumped the gun on that one. There you go. Yeah, most of the time they'll fall over. If they head closer, that means they're going to do more damage. Yeah, they're gonna do more damage. Oh, hey, look at that. I didn't even take a hit on that one. Do you see that, guys? That was pretty epic. Those guys give the most experience in this graveyard. So you definitely want to fight those guys if you're looking for experience here. These are the zombies we just fought. And I don't know how I missed getting a back attack on that guy. It's good to be back recording, too, because, I, you know, I've been in school for a little bit. I'm still in school right now. I mean, this was a school day. I just came home from one, but... At least now it's not like a summer day where I haven't spoken to anybody all day. And because of that, my voice isn't ready to talk to anybody. There you go. Yeah, just around 95 HP. I wanted to buy the Mother 3 handbook, but it's like $30. So instead I ended up, uh, I'm going to be buying the Courage badge. And I'll, maybe I'll show that off in a video to you guys because, uh, man, that Courage badge is so cool. Because I'm just such a big, you know, Mother 3 fanboy. Now, if you want to heal up, you can go to Yato's Inn. But what I recommend is every time you want to heal, go back to your house. This is Maps, and we, I guess we could have it marked in the map. On it. Yeah, we have our map marked, I guess. Just for the heck of it, really. Rumor. Yeah, there's your hint right there. And there it is, marked right there on our map. But, um... I recommend that you go back into your own house and sleep in your bed because you can sleep on any bed that has a blue pillow on it including the bed inside Klaus and Lucas's house even though I don't think you can go in there in this chapter there you get a nice refreshing refreshing heal up it's like eating the lemons it's refreshing <laughs> it's so funny I don't know the stairs work normally on that one and if you go behind the house, just like in Super Mario RPG, if you go behind the house and talk to somebody, but in this case you get a present that has a thunder bomb in it. Really nice explosive for the beginning of his chapter. It definitely is a little bit more powerful than his attacks, so you want to be taking advantage of that whenever you can. Especially if you have enemies ganging up on you. Like, I would ex uh, that would be probably pretty useful on that first fight you have with the zombies. Jeez, can I go through it in one episode without... Messing up the camera a little bit, maybe. Kinda. Anyway, I'm just gonna save here. Oh, by the way, here's the regards of yourself. Save over that, and. Nah, not that one yet. And leaving you with this awesome song. 
will see you guys. I will see you guys next time on Let's Play Mother 3. I can go that low with my boy. Oh, well, whatever. Bye, guys. Thank you for watching this episode.